we are back from the Bahamas and it is Tuesday night, May 9, and we are getting ready to go to the Main Addicts event in Hollywood. So we're gonna go see what that's all about. Say hi. today <laughs> I feel like I can't move my face because this mask will crack May 10 Wednesday and I haven't been vlogged all day because I've just been stuck to the computer all day and it's been really boring and nothing to talk about it is now 6 40 we went to the gym and now I'm doing a mask because I have a problem face right now because I don't know what's going on from the Bahamas I don't know if it's the weather change it was all gloomy and cold when we got here so it's kind of annoying but it's kind of nice um, and I don't know what's going on in my face I don't even know if I should be using this mask to be honest but it's time to relax and watch some shows I'm using the origins mask called clear improvement morning guys it is Thursday May 11 and I'm getting ready I have to meet with two people today around 11 it's still around 8 something just put my makeup on I've been having some trouble matching my new tan to my makeup but anyway I am going to wash some of my brushes I showed you guys last week me unboxing my Sigma stuff and they gave me like the express brush express brush cleaning mat um, along with their like brush shampoo and so I'll just show you guys a little bit of what and how I'm gonna do it Today I had two meetings and they were both about my blog and about YouTube and stuff and so um, when my blog launches which will be hopefully soon like in the next couple weeks um, I probably will be doing a Q&A like every end of the month or something and so I think that would be good because we get a lot of the same questions on YouTube and just you know questions I can just answer um, on the blog um, so be on the lookout. I will be definitely be doing like a launch video to let you guys know. Those of you that follow me on YouTube or on Instagram know that I post a lot of, you know, different outfits that I don't post on YouTube. Um, sometimes they're just daily outfits. It's like stuff that I wore last night, if it's a Friday night, like to my dinner or date night. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, follow me on there so that you could get other daily outfit inspirations and I post on IG stories as well. Who, I know we had this discussion about Poshmark um, in the last vlog and I'm trying to decide Poshmark versus Depop. So will you guys let me know which one is better, but let me know, um, what's more popular. I am gonna take a shower and then I am gonna relax. It is 6.47, I just finished like trying to finalize a menu for the wedding and I'm super excited because the save the dates are here but I missed the postman and I'm supposed to sign for them so I definitely missed him. So I have to go pick up the save the dates at the post office tomorrow all right so my stomach lately has been like a bottomless pit i've been hungry all the freaking time so around like maybe four or five i had in and out and then i just made two grilled cheese sandwiches such like bad diet i feel like and that's probably why i'm having problematic skin 
ever since we get, got back from the Bahamas. It's just been annoying. Um, but anyway, does anyone watch Married at First Sight? It's so cute. I love this show. But anyway, I'm about to watch it. I'm gonna call it a night for this vlog and I'll see you guys tomorrow. So, been a bad vlogger again and it's already Friday at 5.36 and I look like a freaking... Boss. No, I look horrible because I have a tan, and then I have concealer, and then I'm breaking out. I met one of my YouTube friends at the gym, Alyssa, and she was so, so nice and so sweet. So hi, if you're watching. Um, also, when we went to Bahamas at the airport, um, I think her name is Gina. If you're watching, hi Gina. I know you wrote me, you couldn't get, we couldn't meet each other, but I would have loved to have met you. So tired and so like out of it as far as working out. It's been, it's cause I haven't worked out in so long. I didn't work out at all when uh, we were in the Bahamas. Um, even like before that, I feel like I barely worked out. Battery's dying, it's awesome. We got our save the dates back, finally. And they look so good, so I, Probably will show you guys once I send everything out, but it was just exciting to see what they look like. So next thing to do is the invitations, right? I just figured out the wording for the invitations, which was super confusing, and I just kind of finalized a menu also, which was cool. Yep. We're gonna have a dinner, a really good dinner tonight at our favorite restaurant in LA. If you're in LA and you're looking for like the best Italian, go to this place called Capo, it's in Santa Monica. But you gotta make reservations in advance because they always book up. We're heading to dinner and I am wearing, or let's see, Jamie. Jamie is wearing polka dot shirt. <laughs> He's in a monochrome today, all gray. I am wearing this H&M top, drawstring hair and pants that I got from Forever 21. Then I'm just gonna put on some Stuart Weitzman heels. Morning, it's Saturday, May 13, and Jamie went to the gym today, and I opted out, <laughs> and so. Week. Yeah, week. Well, I, wor I worked out yesterday with him, um, and I don't know just didn't feel like going um, and I'm all ready and we're going to the Century City Mall because I want to go to the Aritzia store. Aritzia is huge in the East Coast and I went to the Aritzia store and in Soho last April, right? We went together Yeah. and that was the first time I even heard of it or I bought a whole bunch of stuff from there. So I just want to see it because it's new, that mall has been redone, it's not all done but it should be fun. What is the one thing that irritates you most about your significant other? <laughs> you put me on the spot. This morning, it was <laughs> clothes. Like, messing, messy clothes. Not putting clothes away. Oh, you're asking the audience. You're not I'm asking, asking the audience. Because oh. one of the things that I hate most is when, like, the clothes are not put away neatly. Like, I like to be organized. <laughs> Someone here could care less, <laughs> but I'm sure there's things that I do that make him really irritated too. Oh, but yeah. what is, he <laughs> said, oh yeah, um, the one thing that you do or your significant other does that drives you or him nuts?
success. We got some cute stuff. This place is dangerous. Oh yeah, this is what I'm wearing. This is my outfit. I forgot to show you guys. Forever 21 denim jacket. This is from Naked Fashion. And then my Steve Madden shoes necklace that I turned into a bracelet again by Amanda Deer. My Amanda Deer necklace again. And then my purse that practically goes with everything. Somebody touch your sandwich for you. It is such a pretty day. We just had lunch at the cutest place ever across the mall. It was recommended by the girl that works there. It was so good. Could not make up our minds about what we wanted. We wanted everything. So you guys saw me in Aritzia. So big. So I think I'll do like a haul of some of the new stuff that I have been getting and that I got there. Now the thing that I really like about that place is that they have sizes that come in extra, extra small and then extra small and then they have zero and then they have double zero. Nothing that I bought is anything I'm gonna have to take in. You know, I probably would have to like spend $40 extra when I go to the tailor to get my stuff um, fixed anyway on top of the cost of how much this stuff already is and so sometimes that's where the um, Mentality comes the justification I guess of when I buy stuff like that <laughs> What you doing? Filming you Hello so I am just lying in bed, just waiting for the food to come. Jamie is upstairs with the guys and then we're gonna go out somewhere. Um, so I'm just in the room watching Married at First Sight. Um, not sure where we're going yet, but it will be fun, I think, if I can survive. Okay, so they, these are the guys that we're going out with tonight. This one wants to introduce himself. You guys might notice him in August. You guys might get to um, see him in August because he will be on... No, not August, in May. In May? It's May. Yeah. In May. See, he wants nine to... Days. In nine days. Because The Bachelorette will be on and he will oh, be no. on The Bachelorette. No. <laughs> yes. <laughs> It's, it's like not even two seconds. It's probably one second. You're so humble. <laughs> That's it. Where were you? <laughs> but here's the thing. So they, there's like 30 whatever guys, right? Yeah. Play, play, I'm the only play. one that actually says something. Okay. There he is. Oh, he's in the black. <laughs> So just wanted to show you guys what I'm wearing. It's Sunday, it's around 11. We have just been lounging, watching Naked and Afraid, which is what you see on the TV behind me. Um, so I'm just wearing lace tank top from H&M. It's like a beige color and this long line cardigan that you always see me wearing from ASOS. And then these AG um, cropped frayed jeans look like that. And I think we're just gonna go and get some coffee right now. We got our coffee, share coffee. Oh. And then, <laughs> we can't decide what we want to eat. We were not even going to eat anything, but it's already noon by the time we left, and so maybe we're going to go and get some Shake Shack burger. All right, so we are back home from brunch, and I am definitely masking. I have been having some problematic skin since I got back from the Bahamas, um, and I honestly believe that it is also from this candy that I started eating. It's like the sour candy. I don't know if I mentioned it, and I never eat candy like that, but one of my girlfriends made me try it, and I found it in the airport. Um, and so I bought it, and I had been eating it, and then that's when I noticed that 
my skin had been like breaking out i thought it was like the weather change in the plane which i also think that did like contribute to my skin um being bad but i also think it's from the sugar so it's gotten better since i stopped eating it so that's what i noticed just wearing my peter thomas roth gold mask which is one of my favorite masks ever it was a really expensive mask but i think it's like worth every penny because it's like this big um and i still have a lot left and i've been i've used it so many times already um i just noticed that the next day i'm like glowing my face is bright and i love i love when my um facial complexion is like radiant i'll cook some dinner later so i'll show you guys what i make